Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fireside Terra. I hope everyone is well. Whew. Still working through those January reads. I know I said I wanted to have them done by the end of the week. I was not able to read anything last night when I got home from the bed and butter job or this morning before I had to go back. So we're going to throw down some cards tonight. Do maybe one or two before I sack out. Whew. I'm tired, guys. I'm tired. I'm not going to lie. All right. Anyway, enough babbling. This reading will be for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If it resonates with your sun sign, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards. You choose to do anything at all. It's your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay, too. You can check your Moon, Rising, or Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better. Okay. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid and all things can and maybe vice versa. I even play out from the perspective of the cross watcher. And I just think the cross watchers are always welcome here at the Fire Sign Tarot Table. And just keep in mind, if you absolutely do not believe that this is your story, not your message, not your reading, leave the cards on the table and walk away. Don't take with you what does not belong to you, okay? Alright. Oh, Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. January of 2021. Why are you here, Taurus? Princess of Swords reversed. Lack of communication, possibly blocked. Who are you not talking to? What's going on with that? What do you feel about the person you're dealing with? Six of Pentacles. They could be an extremely generous, charitable person. At the very least, things are equal at this point. Or at least that's how you feel. What do you think? Five of Wands. They could be... You might think they're slightly confrontational. Just a little bit. Maybe it doesn't take much to set them off. I don't know. We want from them three of swords reversed. That's loaded. Oh gosh, that's loaded. I'm to throw a clarifier on that. I feel compelled to th say this. You cannot rely on someone else to heal your broken heart. And the same goes the other way around. You can't be relied on to heal someone else's broken heart. That has to come from inside. Hmm. How do they feel about you? Two of Pentacles reverse. I'm hearing wishy-washy. Can't make up your mind. They feel like you don't know what you want, Taurus. What do they think of you? Queen of Pentacles, they think you're the catch. I mean... Definitely think you got it going on. Maybe some money in the bank, nice house. Possibly you're a business person. I don't know. Take it however it resonates. They definitely think you're a catch. You're a keeper. What do they want from you? Oh. Hereford. This is the marriage card. For some of you. Or... They want that divine blessed union. I mean, well, the card speaks for itself. We'll throw a clarifier on it in a minute. But if y'all ain't talking, obviously there's there's an obstacle. So what's the obstacle? Two of Wands reverse. Someone is having trouble letting go of the past and moving toward the future. Okay. Possible resolution. Five of Pentacles. What? 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 Leave the outcome down. All right. Okay. Let's get some clarity, shall we? Universe, source, and spirit. Can I get some clarity in the cards on the table for Taurus, please? Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, January 2021. What? Nobody panic. I don't think putting somebody in the doghouse is a solution, so let's just see what the rest of the cards have to say, shall we? <sighs> 
Sorry, it was neon. Sometimes she just sends me stuff and I have no idea how to respond to it. So, I'll wait. Seven of Cups reversed. Maybe that's why there's a lack of communication or blocked communication. Can be a card of confusion. Can be a card of not knowing which path or cup to choose. Hmm. All right. We'll buy that for a dollar. Let me know if it resonates. Okay. Huh. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? We'll just go card by card. One card. One card in the Six of Pentacles, please. Why not? Eight of Cups. That changes things a little bit. That That's a card of walking away. You're fair, you're equal, you're charitable. Sorry, they're fair, equal, charitable. All things being even. Why the Eight of Cups? Gosh. Queen of Wands. Oh, maybe that's why. I'm hearing, I'm sensing, I'm feeling... Queen of Wands knows what she wants and she goes after what she wants and if you don't give her what she wants she's going to walk away. Might be a fire sign or a water sign you're dealing with. Could be. If it's your story, okay. If it's not, yeah. Hmm. That's super weird. But it explains the Five of Wands. Let's get a more explanation on the Five of Wands. Why is the Five of Wands here? Queen of Cups. Loving. Possibly a little bit emotional, but a loving person. That cup of love is full. But there's that Five of Wands confrontational energy there. Page of Cups reversed. Mm. Mm. The words may not always come out right. If that makes sense to anybody. Why is the Three of Swords reversed here for what Taurus wants from or for the other person? Magician manifesting new things. One more. Oh, hi. Three of Cups. Manifesting anew, healing a broken heart, coming together. Possibly on just a friendship level. I mean, it could be. But it's definitely a card of like reunion or union. Maybe they want to start talking again. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows, Doris? Who knows? Why is the Two of Pentacles here? Hi. Hangman. One more. Emperor. Oh, well. <sighs> hmm. Possibly indecisive. 
can't quite make up their mind about you. This emperor, maybe you're family oriented. I only I only say that about this particular emperor because you know he's I don't know if there's kids or his grandkids, but that, he's got like that that proud dad face on. Like you know, he's the he's the king of his castle. He's the master of his house, ruler of his empire. Blah 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 blah. blah you know. be a Pisces, could be an Aries. I mean, why the hanged men? Why the hanged men? The fool. Mmm. Mmm. How they feel about you. Ready to jump. Can't quite make up your mind. Jumps easily. Always on the lookout for something new. Might not want to settle down. Everything's an adventure. I'm going to leave that alone. Why the Queen of Pentacles? With a fortune reversed, four cups reversed. They think you're the catch. One more. Oh, shadow side reversed. Okay. I'm here in hot mess. Like on the outside, you know, going by appearances alone, you're large and tired, you got your crap together, maybe you got a nice house, good job, and things are going well. But underneath that surface, it is a hot mess. I don't know if there's some toxic or binding things going on, but the shadow side reverse popped up. That's the devil card in this particular deck. The four cups reversed. I'm hearing I can't take the cup. I can't take the cup. I can't take the cup. I don't, they don't want to ignore the cup. It's like they're not exactly in a position where they can right now. It's not that they don't want to. It's just they're not in a position where they can. Okay, well, well, maybe things aren't going so well right now on the inside of the situation. Well, why is the hair from here? I really hate it when they land on the floor. Six of Pentacles reversed. They want that blessed union, but it's not an equally felt situation. Oh, come on. Fall off the table again. Three of Wands upright. It's, they gotta wait. They might want to wait for things to level off. Okay, well that's fair. That's fair. Maybe things need to level off. Because someone hasn't let go of something. Two of Wands reversed. Why is the Two of Wands reversed here? Hi. Strength. Somebody's holding back. Maybe it takes a great deal of courage to let go of that wand and move forward. The 
Five of Pentacles. Mm, I'm hearing cold winter. We're not quite sure if those five pentacles left on that tree are going to hang on till spring, are you? Mm -mm, no. I don't think... Somebody's like in contemplation mode. Five pentacles, five pentacles. Well, there's your answer. There's your answer. Why the five pentacles? Ace of Wands. Seven Pentacles reversed. One more. Six of Cups. OMG. People gotta wait. Six of Cups comes after the five. Fives are the cards of change. I'm hearing wait it out till spring. I don't know why. Probably because the five of wands, I'm sorry, the ace of wands represents fire. Fire starts the zodiac wheel all over again in spring when Aries comes. Could be. It's putting together pictures, guys. It's putting a puzzle together. That's what tarot is. You put the puzzle together. You make it make sense. Why the Six of Cups? The Knight of Wands. Here's another fire sign card, Taurus. Could be a fire sign that you're dealing with. The Knight of Wands, he's free. Slightly reckless. Can be. Doesn't necessarily have to be. I'm hearing and feeling just enjoy the moment. Enjoy the good times. Enjoy how it makes you feel. Don't lose patience. And wait it out and see what happens. What's the uh, outcome here? This ain't over. World reversed. Story ain't over yet, guys. Story ain't over yet. This is not calling for an ending. One on, one on the world reversed, please. Ten of wands reversed. That's another, it ain't over. The fat lady is yet to sing. Eight of wands reversed. You may be like incommunicado for a minute until someone, okay, one more. I'm hearing someone needs to like, I don't know, get up the courage to get things off their chest, maybe? And the, the story ain't over? Seven of Wands, yeah. Came out in the upright. It's a card of... Pick your moment. Moment's not here yet. Cycle's not over. Taurus. 
get your advice. Whew. Okay. Now I'm dropping quartz all over the place. Empress and the Hanged Man. Spring birth renewal. Four of Cups reversed, Prince of Swords reversed. I'm not going to say ignore the cup until you're ready. Think it over a little bit more. think it over a little bit more. And I'm going to say it again. You can't count on someone else to heal your broken heart. It's not what this is about, guys. Princess of Wands and the Two of Cups reversed. <clears throat> Don't stay hung up in the gallows. And emotionally burdened so much to the point where you miss an opportunity or you miss the catch. <sighs> Let's see what this one has to say. Five of Cups reversed, Ten of Cups reversed. Don't stand. Don't stand at the shore of the ocean of tears and miss your happiness. At some point, you need to make the decision to let go. I'm not saying you got to do it today. I'm not saying you got to do it tomorrow. But don't stay at that shore forever. It might be bitch to just lay low for a little while. Stay stay in communicado for a while, but not forever. Just when you're ready. But don't rush this. Because if you rush this and do this before you're ready, it's going to end up right back at a disconnect again. Six of Wands reversed. Karma reversed. You don't get your victory. You don't get your do-over. Okay, Taurus, I don't know who the heck this was for or what the heck this was about, but this was fun. Let me know if it resonated. Okay? And I will catch you guys. Uh, it's Saturday night, so either Sunday night or Monday morning for your weekend. Sorry, work week, top and bottom of the deck. Catch you later.